Hey guys, you're watching carbio.com.sg and I'm sure you've heard of the Vision Gran Turismo project where car makers work with the video game Gran Turismo to create their idea of a perfect sports car inside the game. Now Mercedes, Lexus, Volkswagen and a whole bunch of other brands have done it but what makes Audi different is that it actually built a real working car that is the Audi e-tron Vision GT. But what's the point of all that really? Well, as you know, Audi just unveiled the e-tron, a fully electric SUV that's coming to Singapore next year. And it also announced something like the real life version of the Vision GT, that's the e-tron GT coming in 2020. So to get a taste of Audi's blend of Quattro e-performance of the near future, it actually flew its factory racing driver, Rahel Fry, here to Singapore along with the e-tron Vision GT and even better we managed to get a ride inside it we live to tell the tale and to ask us some questions afterwards so here it is no engine noise designed for a game, for Gran Turismo. So first it was just a vision, it was virtual and then in the end it became reality. Because Audi thought, hey, we love that car, we need to have it. And um, afterwards Audi, AG, built the car to take it on track for some taxi rides. Um, it's a really fast car, we have more than 800 horsepower with a weight of uh, a little bit more than 1,400 uh, kilo. Um, so we will reach um, zero to 100 within 2.5 seconds. That's really, really fast. We have three electric engines on the car, one on the front axle, two on the rear axle. The car has a lot, a lot of momentum. Um, each electric engine will uh, have a momentum of 330 newton meters. So it's a lot of power. It's take the full control of it, which makes it really, really interesting. And 800 horsepower, that's not usual to have it in a race car. So it's something special, it's really unique, and uh, it's, it's, it's impressive. It's impressive to drive. It's quite similar. Same thing in the game, accelerating and deceleration. Deceleration is really impressive. It's really impressive, main difference to some other cars in the game as well. Same thing here in reality. The most important part is the power, how powerful an electric car the e can be. Yeah, uh, I grew up in a car dealership, so we grew up around cars, which is uh, yeah, quite interesting, isn't it? Then we started in, in go-karting, I together with my siblings, and uh, then I went up, cl climbed up um, to different, different formula categories. Then I got involved um, in the Audi program, started um, to drive for Audi in 2011, for DTM, in DTM. Um, over in Asia, the, it's, it's well known, the Super GT a little bit. And uh, yeah, since then I'm, I'm driving for Audi all around the world. So right now I'm driving uh, the R8 LMS GT3 car in some different, different series. And uh, yeah, I'm really proud of, I'm enjoying myself, it's, it's a hard role. Definitely the motorsport business, but as a girl, you always have to double proof yourself. But when you are competitive, it always pays off. What my theory is that uh, go fast and never ever give up, right? So that that's the that's the for me the most important thing. Never ever give up. Even someone tells you, hey, you're not good enough, 
just work harder for it. Aim for, keep on working and work always pays off. So um, yeah, we, we always have some races which are not successful at all. Just keep on going. Go out and track and try it again.